Is it hard to access affordable, healthy food? Then listen carefully. Daryl Addison, an African-American inventor, has patented a process for growing food on demand. He called it Torpedo Pot. Torpedo Pot is a fully automated flower pot that gives you control over your plant's environment. All you do is add soil, seeds, and plants to the flower pot and watch it grow. Yes, Torpedo Pot grows the rest. Visit www.torpedopot.com. We have a story out of North Idaho where at a public, you know, meeting for the city council, they have one of these minority coalition members decide to get up and she wanted to address um, the term patriot and what she feels the term patriot really means. Um, and I really want you to hear what this woman says, even with her grandchild. Let's roll that clip. Support our businesses and protect them. And then everyone's called a white supremacist. I'm sorry, but we're not white supremacists. Well, I guess I'm not. Yes, I am. Because the new, the term nowadays, white supremacist, means you're a patriot. So I have a sign that I do carry sometimes, and I say proud white supremacist, because a white supremacist is a patriot. And I don't appreciate defining people by their race, by their sex, by their beliefs, by their values, etc. We are all Americans, and I think coming up with a resolution like that, like that divides our city even further. And I don't appreciate the suggestion and I had no intent to speak but now I'm mad so anyway thank you very much I appreciate you allowing me to speak so now this woman clearly isn't white she even said that well I can't be a white supremacist but say oh yeah I can oh no 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 you can be a white supremacist you do not have to be white to be a white supremacist white supremacists can be any color in America and even black oh yes if they have the ideology of white supremacy, even black people have that ideology. They don't have the social currency behind the ideology. I will say that much. They don't have that, but they can have a lot of white supremacist views, even black folk, all these other races of people. Some of them is classified as white. They're not white, but they classified as white. Oh, they look at that as a badge of honor. Some of them. So they want to make sure to show the real white supremacists that they are thankful. I mean, this woman says that, she walks around saying she's a white supremacist because white supremacist means patriot. No, it don't. White supremacists do not mean patriot at all. That is the, a perversion of the word patriot. The white supremacists have perverted patriotism, perverted it. Patriotism is supposed to be honorable, not, not tarnished with the lowest of the low in America. The people that ain't worth a drop of piss, the white supremacists. Why would you want to attach them to Patriot? But that's what they're doing now. They are calling themselves Patriots and that's just code word for white supremacy. You have these quote unquote minorities, right? They're talking about we have a minority coalition. That's why I don't even want to hear the term minority coalition or anything because these other groups are trying to get to a proximity of whiteness that they will never really attain because when the rubber meets the road, white folks know who white. And they'll put any of those non-whites in their place when they feel like they need to, when they get out of line. You understand? But yeah, this, this is why I told you, we black folks got to be looking out for black folk. Because if you don't, we're going to be in trouble. And that's why you, we have to circle our wagons, you know, in, in this day and time. We cannot have this unsure, you know, what we're going to do, um, these other groups you know, want to pop, play to play both sides. No, we can't do that. If you're on the side of white supremacy, go ahead, stay over there. But right now we just trying to fix our community. What we got going on. And I told black folk, you got to be extremely selfish right now, extremely selfish and looking out for us. We have done our time looking out for everybody else. We've served everybody else. We've worked for everybody else. So now we need the next 500 years to be selfish. It's okay. Black people to be selfish. It's okay. It's okay to look out for black people. It is, I'm telling you, I'm giving you permission to look out for black people. It's not wrong. It's not against God or anything. Look at them Ukrainians up there. They're looking out for themselves. Even the Africans got that wake up call and, and they did the right thing. 
actually. But this woman is just, <laughs> I shake my head, but you know, this, this is why, you know, every day that I'm saying that we have to unify because these people here, like I say, they're losing their freaking mind. But leave me a comment. Let me know what think about the situation here. Oh, this woman says she's a white supremacist. That's, that's, at least she's open with it. I give her that.